Hello, and welcome to the Hopo Vibe. I'm Savannah. And I'm Zay. Let's get this party started. For our first segment, we are going to talk about softball. We, we are, are Jayla and Destiny with the Hopo Vibe talking about softball. I play softball for both. I really like the experience and like being in softball. But I also do see a future in me playing softball, but it's more for the experience. I've been playing for three years. Um, accountability is my top notch. So benefits for softball, my players will be held accountable. They know um, and have a family within softball. We are a tight niche that they could enjoy. I always have pictures on my wall so they can come back and see what they did, how they did, and then talk um, as a family. They would know how to be team players outside of softball and outside once they graduate from this actual school they can actually t take their leadership they can take their development and their motivation outside of school and softball and that's all from the hopewell vibe now it's time for our staff spotlight my job title is a biology teacher and i teach biology My why for teaching is to develop these students or develop my students into uh, critical thinkers so they can know how to conquer anything, not just academically, but just throughout life. I am very pleased uh, with everything that I've accomplished thus far, but I do know that my job is not done yet. Um, I believe that my path prepared me for my job by setting you up, si simply setting me up for success. I went to school for secondary education and biological science, so I was fully prepared to teach biology. And also, I went to a high school that was similar to Hopewell High, so I do know how to build relationships with students and. Um, I feel like I'm in a place where I can understand where they come from because I too walked a similar path as a lot of my students. I'm not really sure, but I would probably say that they would probably say I'm friendly, outgoing, outspoken, but yet passionate about teaching. What did you do over break? I was in intercession. We did play rehearsals. Well, over break, the HHS band had the performance of a lifetime, where they performed at an NBA game. During our break, I had a chance to hang out with Mr. Pierce and the marching band. They were heading to perform in Washington, D.C. to do a halftime show for the NBA. Well, this is uh, so a huge opportunity for our band program. This is our second or third time being on an international stage like this. And so it's a big thing for our program. This is our first time going to the NBA game. And so, you know, I told the kids today at rehearsal that this is huge. Like, you get to tell your kids about this, that you were the first to do an NBA game. I feel like this is a great opportunity. I have always wanted to, I've always wanted to go to an NBA game, and now I finally have the chance and I'm kind of happy to be on TV, and I think this is just going to be a great experience overall, and I hope that we mostly get to do it again. Um, it's pretty exciting. We get to go to like a national level. People can see us like all over the world on TV. It's pretty fun. The Washington Wizards organization reached out to us um, through a friend of mine uh, who had contact with the Wizards organization, and asked us could we were we available to fill two games that they had open. We we do practice like extensively every other day. Even though it's not as big as our regular shows, it still feels like we're practicing for like a big show. Tonight's halftime entertainment is here. Please welcome Hopewell High School, the Marching Blue Devils.
because a lot of people don't get a, don't get this opportunity to do stuff like this. I think all the we're the only two groups in in the state that actually do this. This is Mr. Smith with the Hopewell Vibe. Now it's time for Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? This is Michael from the Whole World Vibe, and I wanted to ask you, do you think you're smarter than a fifth grader? I hope so. Alright, the question is, what is the process called when a caterpillar is turning into a butterfly? Oh my gosh! I know the answer. Wait, wait, wait. Caterpillar goes no, into a moth caterpillar. No, a caterpillar goes into a butterfly and it goes into a cocoon. No. What is the stage of a caterpillar turning into a butterfly called? Metamorphosis. Oh my gosh, I don't know the answer. <laughs> I do know the answer. Metamorphosis. I wanted to say metamorphosis, but not. That's your final answer? Yes. That is correct. Oh, that's what I was going to say. Who a butterfly? A metamorphosis. Yes. What is the process called when a caterpillar is turning into a butterfly? Is it metamorphosis? Yeah. I told you so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Do you think you're smarter than a fifth grader? I know this one. Hold on. Um, wait, no, no, no. Literally, hold on. I swear to God, I know it. Photosynthesis. No. I knew that I want the right answer. Do you mean what's their little house the they live in? The process. Well, they're in a cocoon, and the process is a metamorphosis. Okay, the caterpillar has to. I'm going to a cocoon. And no, like, what is it called? The process? Mm hmm. What is it the process called? Hold on. Guys, I don't know the process of that. I don't know what it's called. Hello, this is Michael from the Whole World Vibe. And we want to ask you, do you think you're smarter than a fifth grader? Uh, possibly. All right. So the question is, what is the process called when it's turning into a butterfly? Metamorphosis. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Do you think you're smarter than a fifth grader? Yes. All right. The question is, what is it called? What is the process called when a caterpillar is turning into a butterfly? <coughs> Metamorphosis. Yes. Ding, 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 ding. All right, this is Michael from the Whole Well Vibe, and I wanted to ask you, do you think you're smarter than a fifth grader? We're about to find out. <laughs> All right, our question is, what is the process called when a caterpillar is turning into a butterfly? Mm. I want to say, like, me metamorphosis? Yeah. Sweet. That's going to do it for the Hope Well Vibe. See you next time. You know who made it.